Ukraine's defense forces eliminated about 394,270 Russian invaders between February 24, 2022 and February 10, 2024. The General Staff of the Armed Forces of Ukraine said this in a post on Facebook.in edition, Ukraine's defense forces destroyed 6,394 enemy tanks, 11,942 armored fighting vehicles, 9,459 artillery systems, 981 multiple rocket launchers, 666 anti-aircraft warfare systems, 332 warplanes, 325 helicopters, 7,235 tactical unmanned aerial systems, 1,881 cruise missiles, 24 warships-slash-cutters, 1 submarine, 12,579 trucks and fuel tankers, and 1,512 pieces of special equipment. It is impossible to gain an accurate picture of the true scale of Russian losses. However, Western experts and governments broadly agreed that more than 300,000 of Moscow's troops have been killed or injured by the final months of 2023, and that figure will now have risen. Both Moscow and Kiev are tight-lipped about their own losses, rarely nodding to their own casualty counts or how much equipment has been destroyed. It is very difficult to determine casualties in an ongoing conflict since both sides will try to keep the data secret and inflate the number of adversary casualties," Marina Myron, a postdoctoral researcher in the Department of War Studies at King's College London in late December. The British Defence Ministry said the average number of Russian casualties sustained each day had risen by almost 300 per day throughout 2023 compared to the previous year. If Russia's casualty count stays the same. Throughout 2024, Moscow will have sustained more than 500,000 casualties in the war by 2025, the UK government said.